Hey there, and welcome to another Factorio Mod Spotlight. I'm Exterminator, and thank you so much for joining me today. And in this spotlight, we are going to be covering the Reusable Robots mod. Uh, this is a very new mod, a couple days old, and I figured it deserves some more attention. It's a very, very cool mod, I think. Uh, what it does is it allows you to reuse the uh, like corpses or shells of um, combat robots that have died due to their lifespan ending. Uh, now if they're destroyed, you obviously can't reuse them. However, if you have extras or you accidentally throw them out or, or what have you, um, then it allows you to reuse them. Uh, the, the corpses that they drop, it drops some little shells that you can then reuse to make more, which is really nice. It kind of recycles it, makes it not super expensive, you know, when you go through them fairly quickly, uh, in that manner at least. So I've thrown some out, and they should be expiring shortly. These only last like 45 seconds. These guys I threw out a few, like a little while ago, and then I just threw the Defender out, and there you go. So these just expired, so did this one. These should shortly here, and you can see these have now left corpses on the ground, and you just automatically pick them up so you don't even have to really do anything except just run over them. Um, and then these would do the same. And uh, if you go into your menu here, your combat menu to craft these, you can see these dropped and left some as well. And they have a different icon so you can tell them apart. Uh, and then you craft them from this. So if you want to just craft new ones, you would do this. Um, but then you have these other ones uh, that are crafted from the Defender Corp. So it is a one-to-one -one conversion. So um, you know, you get three corpses um, from a set of distractors because it throws out three of them, and then you get five from the destroyers, and then one from the defender. And then you just recraft them, which is super nice. Now, you notice probably there is a, another type of robot here, and this is a new robot that the mod adds as well, and this is the DU Defender Capsule. Uh, this is basically a higher level of the vanilla Defender Capsule um, using uranium rounds. So... Obviously, more of a late game thing, uh, but if you want to combine your damage types, uh, for example, maybe you want, you know, some electrical damage from these guys, and then you also want uh, some very heavy, you know, physical piercing damage and such from the uh, uranium rounds, you can do that. Much like you combine laser and gun turrets, and you can build these, and they also have, of course, the same feature of having the reusability when they expire from the timer running out. Again, uh, you cannot... Uh, rebuild these if they actually die from being destroyed. Uh, but I'm going to just demonstrate these really quick. We already know how vanilla combat robots work, but I'm going to demonstrate these really quickly. Obviously, they're using uranium ammo. I do have all tech unlocked, so my upgrades are very high. Um, but you can see that they do demolish things. If you at least had the um, you know tech up to some space science and stuff, these would do a ton of damage. And even if you didn't, they'd do still quite a lot of damage. So there you go, folks. That is the uh, mod, if we look in technology, uh, we can see uh, here for, if we look at combat robots, maybe finding the things are a little bit difficult. Uh, follow robot count, construction, follow robot, worker cargo. So I don't believe there's technology for this. Uh, it's very kind of difficult to find the tech, but I don't think there's. I imagine these just unlock with the combat robots. Uh, we could look again under, like, Defender, maybe. Uh, yeah, so Defender Capsule, as I suspected, it unlocks with the tech for the uh, capsule that it's for. And uh, settings, last thing to check out for the settings. There are none. Pretty straightforward. And that should do it. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I do hope you enjoy. And if you found it helpful, a like is appreciated as well so other people can find it and uh, hopefully, you know, maybe add a cool mod to their gameplay. And if you are new to the channel, feel free to subscribe to keep up with all new content. I'd love to hear your thoughts below, any questions as well. And until next time, I look forward to seeing you all, and do take care.